Hello everybody and welcome back to tutorials with me, with Rock. Um, I haven't done one in quite some time. It's uh, I've been trying to think of what I wanted to do. I've been wanting to play the Infernal Binds on here, but I, I didn't want to do it like everybody else. I didn't want to just do a playthrough like every single other person does. Uh, so I decided I'm going to do a little different. I'm not going to do a straight out playthrough. I'm not going to show you every single thing I do. Um, I'm going to show you the important stuff. I'm, it's going to be very very high on spoilers. I'm not going to lie about that. Uh, if you're watching this, you're just going to have to expect that. Uh, right now I'm just get, gather, gathering some glowstone. Just to, just to make sure I have some kind of lighting once I'm, I start this map. So let me just grab a few of these. Alright. Should be almost enough. I just want to stack. 16 should be fine. Alright. Oh, and I changed my skin. If anyone's played Borderlands, uh, that's Mordecai. The one with uh, Bloodwing. He's my favorite character of any video game of all time. And I finally found his skin, so this is what I'm going to be using from now on. <sighs> Sorry, I'm enjoying a nice cup of coffee this morning. Alright. So what I'm going to do instead is, uh, I'm going to show you how to get, how to get through each of the skylights. I'm going to show you how to get each piece of wall. I'm going to show you where each intersection intersection is, and if I have time in between episodes or something like that, I'll show you where there's some like powerful loot, like certain stuff. Um, I'm expecting people that are watching these to have played the map, uh, to understand the map. Uh, I will read the rules real quick. I'm not going to take any of these books off. They're pretty self-explanatory. Uh, choosing your path says, which one do I want to start with? I'll show you all three of them. I'm going to go through each one of them. Uh, other notes is just stuff like uh, towards the end of the map, your computer might not be able to handle it. Right. Um, some of the rules, we got find and complete the victory monument. Use easy, never peaceful. I'm going to be using normal. Do not leave map boundaries. Uh, you can't. If you can, then... Props to you. Uh, find the wool in the chest. Do not use sheeps, dyes, or spider silks. Survive in any way you can think of. You may craft the resource blocks for the victory monument, the iron, gold, and diamond. You may use spider string, wool for non victory uses, aka beds. You may not pick up, move, or craft ender chests. Uh, which, which is stupid. It has something to do with like you can go grab the wool, put it in the ender chest, kill yourself. And then the ender chest will be at the monument. So, expecting people to have played this map, or at least know the map, know what the, know like what the map is. Let's turn this up a little bit. Uh, this isn't going to be like a straight walkthrough. I'm not going to show you every little thing in every little area. It's more of just how to beat it. I'm not going to show you, hey, this one area has chests everywhere. I'm going to give you a direct path, the easiest, most efficient way to get the wool. So, that's what we're going to do. I'm going to show you the three skylights first, and then I'm going to show you how to find uh, the white wall, and then the intersection, and then we'll go from there. We're gonna... Each video is going to be one of its own things, so this video will be skylight A, which is wood, then we'll do skylight B, which is food, then we'll do skylight C, which is equipment. Uh, what I'm going to do is beat this one, uh, get everything to a certain spot, and then uh, kill myself so I spawn right back here. And then do this one, do the same thing, do this one, and then I'll have them all. And I'll, I'll, I'll be able be able to have shown you each one. So let's keep move on. Uh, we're going to start with wood. Uh, and they're going to start you in this little room. Grab the bed. Uh, there's a ceiling with uh, lava on top of it. Um, there's a direct path out of here, right there. You have no blocks, you have no wood, you have no equipment. Uh, first thing you want to do, you want to get over here. Uh, you can break this block if you want to be safe. I'm not too worried about it. I've done this a few times. I'm going to go around this. And then... I'm sure there's something up there. I've never went to look. Just because right here you're always uh, in a hurry. You want to get this and get out pretty much. So I'm going to get this. Put this up here. Oops, I don't want to do that. Uh, let's craft this. Uh, first thing I want to say is I am going to die. There's no doubt in my mind. I, I die when I'm playing it on my own. Especially with like thinking about this and stuff. Oh yeah, Z still missed this the first time around. Uh, so expect it. Don't be alarmed when I do. 
like that. At least I didn't die. I'll show you what this guy is too in a second. At least I got some blocks. There you go. Oh, he caught me on fire. I'm gonna die, Jesus. <laughs> All right, so we got some blocks now. Let's craft the way over real quick because I don't want to die. Perfect. All right, so flame bringers back there. That's this. Uh, it's got unbreaking enchantment level 100. It will never break and knock back one. Be sure not to miss it. It's in the out in the open right there. You don't want to be like certain derpy pigmen, <laughs> so don't miss it. <laughs> Sorry, I'm off. Uh, my allergies are killing me today. I'll across this bridge, and this is why I told I said to grab some uh, glowstone. It's pretty dark. Uh, there's no light sources around. I'll throw it right there too. Go down here. The, the main th the main goal right here is just to get across this bridge. Uh, easier said than done, obviously. Don't want to fall off that edge. All right. Don't look down. Yeah, I really don't want to. It's it's dark. Uh, what I want to do is, uh, I kind of want to eat. Yeah, let's eat. Let's run up here. Alright, hopefully the poison won't last too long. Well, even if it does, it can't kill you. Alright, I'm going to let my health regen, and I'll be right back. Alright, I got about half health. I don't want to sit up there too long, because then monsters will start to spawn. Spider uh, skeleton shoots so much faster in this new patch. Alright, he's gone. Two guys up here. Put some fire down. Maybe we'll follow into it. Yeah, they don't. They don't. They're not too smart when it comes to fire. another one. Let's get across this damn bridge. <laughs> Later. Alright, so that was Skylight A. Now we're moving into the upper mines. Uh, we want to get right over here. Um, this is, in my opinion, the easiest of the Skylights. Uh, I've done all three of them, and this one is definitely easier than the others. So, FYI. You want an easy first one to get equipped? This is the one to go. You want a challenge? Jesus. If you want a challenge, go with Skylight C. I will show I'll do that one last. Oh, that one's hard. But fun. I mean they're all fun. Everything in this game is fun. Alright, make sure you have a wall near you, so then he can't knock you off. It's still trying to load itself in. Of course, there's going to be monsters down there. Holy crap, a lot of them, too. Let's try it like this. Oh, sweet. See my flame burners, too. And my bed. Alright, we're just going to go. Let them do whatever they want to do. We get over here, we go down this path. And there's nothing out here right now. Uh, this is the upper mines. As you can see, it's it's pretty cool. It's, it's really nice. Uh, let's get in here. Let's get some equipment and stuff. At least get a weapon. Um, yeah, we'll do it like that. I'll have a pick, I'll have blocks. Get up in here. Just check anything in there. Nope. Alright. This is uh, the storage room for the wood in Skylight A.
pick up our reserve saplings in the Everforge. We'll get there. Also, there's a rogue log of lava for the kill their staircase. It sure did. Uh, please try to conserve our wood. Yeah, uh, this is a lot of wood to start the game off. I'm not going to lie. Uh, you won't need more until you get to another intersection. Uh, this is why I wanted to come here before I kept trying to uh, fight on. Because now I have a sword with... Uh, what is this? Sharpness 1, Fire 4, I'm breaking 2, so... I'm a little set now. Uh, we got three backup swords. I got a full set of armor. So let's grab that. Throw it on. Uh, we got some torches. We got some arrows and a bow. Two picks. A couple sword. A couple axes. A couple shovels. Right there. Right there. Right there. And like so. Throw this up here. Sorry, I'm a little OCD when it comes to my equipment. Alright. Uh, and here we have a bunch of wood. Right, three stacks of wood. Uh, three stacks of wood will definitely get you through the beginning of this map. Uh, I'm going to cut all this down though, just so I have it. Alright, just about done cutting all the wood. My last little stack. Grab this real quick. And so, that was Skylight A. It was pretty simple. Uh, I died once. I'm going to die in each one of them, I'm sure of it. Uh, here's one thing. These two pieces of dirt in the center, grab them. I know I was going to say that I wasn't going to say anything special, but if you're playing, if you're in the beginning of this game, those are the only two pieces you're going to find. Uh, so, I grab everything. We'll just strip this place. Alright, that was that room. Stripped it. I could take all the glowstone, but I'm not, not that crazy. Uh, so, close that up. Ourselves a skeleton, but now I'm fully stacked. Bob and weave, Bob and weave, and you still got me. Right. Yeah, it's a little darker here. All right, but that's a good start, definitely. Uh, that's in that's Skylight A. Uh, next video is going to be Skylight B, and then Skylight C, and then I'm going to show you how to get the white wall, and then the intersection. So one, two, yeah, a few videos, and then we'll move on to the next intersection. I'm expecting this to be a full length series. I hope you guys like it. Uh, I'm I'm totally burnt out of Feed the Beast. I haven't played it in weeks. That's why I haven't put a video up. I've just been playing, playing this. Uh, if you don't like it, I'm sorry. I'll try to put out some videos from it, but uh, like every so often when me and my buddies are messing around, I'll, I'll start recording and throw something out, but uh, tutorials are on, a, on the back burner right now, so I'm sorry. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you're playing Infernal Mines, good luck to you. I hope you make it far. Uh, I hope you don't die. Try the death counter too, because that's always fun to see how many times you died. Uh, you guys take care of yourselves, and I will see you next video.